Let me tell you about the birds and the bees, and not the traditional lessons that we all learned in school, but something that's critically important, and that is sustainability for the future of all of our lives. The birds and the bees are leading indicators on the state of the environment. And I'm gonna focus on the birds today. And if you can just imagine a world without the birds and the bees, what it would look like. Roughly about 10 years ago, I was introduced to a retired gentleman, and his name was Dave. And Dave was an ornithologist. And an ornithologist is basically an expert on birds. And Dave took the time to educate me on something I knew very little about. And that was the importance of birds in society. Dave went on to explain that without the birds uh, surviving, it would impact the, the, the bugs and the bees and, and ultimately lead to impacting our food chain. Dave was, although he was retired, he was very passionate about the birds and he took the time to go to the local hardware stores and collect wood and then go to the old age homes and have people put these nest boxes together and the reason being is urban sprawl is a serious factor for all of us. As more and more houses are built, there's just less space for the animals and the birds. So Dave would build these nest boxes, put them out, and do the best he could to record what was taking place. The problem was the boxes wouldn't last very long. They really didn't have enough manpower to do this properly. And that's where Clean River got involved. We came up with an idea and it was called Project Nest Box. We wanted to get the kids involved. And what we did as a manufacturer working with recycled material, we designed the ultimate bird nesting box and we used all of our scrap materials and we put together a little program where there was instructions on how to put the box together. And then we started offering it to the local schools just to see what kind of an impact this could have. The first year started off with, I believe we chose 30 schools and we supplied them with 30 kits, with books, with posters identifying. And the real goal was for the kids to be part of a science project where they would assemble the, the nest box stations, set them up and record the data on how many birds moved in, how many eggs were laid, how many eggs survived. And all of this data would be recorded and sent off to a central pool to record the local data on the bird population. After that, we received a lot of positive impact and Project Next Box took flight. So going forward the next year, we would send off to at least 100 schools, three different boxes, and the program grew. It was even picked up by Eco Schools, uh, a program within Ontario. To this day, Project Next Box has expanded to every province in Canada. We've moved into the United States with it and also across the pond in Europe. Project Nest Box is our way of giving back to the community and in that package comes the complete instructions uh, and also each school receives a book on identifying every known species of birds in North America. As the program grows, we feel great to see the impact it's having overall on our environment and again, as Clean Rivers being part of the solution and not part of the problem. I'm Bruce Bucking encouraging you to never waste a moment and try something new like bird watching.